how can I monetize my YouTube channel? Stick around, watch this whole video to the end because I'm going to bless you guys with something. So as my YouTube journey grows, I'm going to show you guys my video analytics, not my analytics, but my video views right here in this video. I got 12 views now in this video. I got way more than 12. That's because I stayed consistent. I kept posting. Yeah, those 12 views or sometimes people might only got three views. It can be discouraging, but every day you post, you're creating a craft. Every day you post, you being consistent and you also getting the confidence to where I'll, when you when I post, guys, to get the fear out of me, the Bible says, and I am a Christian content creator. The Bible says that love cast out fear. God did not give us the spirit of fear. He gave us the spirit of a sound mind in Christ. So before you upload, if you, you know, if you, um, let me say, if you're shy or if you feel like, you know, you can't anxiety. <laughs> if that kicks in, talk to God, talk to God, say, God, I'm just going to let you use me on this video. I'm about to load. That's what I just did. You know, even when I mess up, some people say you didn't mess up, but sometimes I feel that I did mess up when I rewatch my videos. I'm like, ah, oh, I could have said that better, but I still kept loading. I still kept posting. And that's what you're going to do. People are going to understand you because they see your face. They see you. They see your your emotions and they see your personality. They ain't going to care if you twist your words. They ain't going to care if you say the wrong words. They ain't going to. I said the wrong words in one of my videos. I was supposed to say uh, when you do a video, don't wear sunglasses instead of me saying sunglasses i messed up in one of my videos you can go back and look i said glasses and i said it a few times in my videos i messed up and i went back and saw my videos i was like oh but my comment section people were happy people got the tips my my um yeah people sent me messages saying man i like that video and i'm like i messed up but they don't care they got something out of that video. They got value out of that video. And so I'm sure I'm here to encourage you that if you mess up or don't add a word or take out a word or forget to add a word, don't be discouraged. Keep going. Keep uploading. Because once God use you, it ain't going to matter. It ain't going to matter how you mess up. It ain't going to matter when you mess up. It ain't going to matter if you tongue tied or you have a brain fart. <laughs> it ain't going to matter because the viewers will resonate with your personality. God did not give you the spirit of fear. Before you upload, talk to God. Say, God, I'm I'm afraid to upload. God, give me the courage, God. God, use my mouthpiece. God, use my eyes. I don't even look at the camera. I'm looking straight in that red or that uh, not red, but green dot that's got record on it right in that camera. I'm looking right in that camera and I don't have to look at myself because if I look at myself, I'm going to mess up. I'm going to say I'm going to be too busy looking at myself. That's a distraction. You don't want a distraction. The enemy likes to distract you. Like I'm parked in my, uh, I'm in my vehicle, cars driving by, I don't care. People driving by, I don't care. I'm not letting that distraction uh, get me off focus from posting a video for YouTube to show you guys my journey. This is my transparent journey. I'm not doing no editing. Editing is tough. I don't, I'm not an edit guru. I can't even, I cannot edit. I tried to edit on some of the videos. I did good, but it's really, really overwhelming when you add it. And when you add it and you try to get it right, you will mess up. And it, some people got it. Some people can play the piano without missing the keynote. Some people just got it natural. Some people can hit a basketball or shoot a basket in a hoop naturally. Some people got that editing skills naturally. But me, I don't. 
I am not going to edit. I'm just saying, man, I'm I'm just going to take this YouTube to the next level without editing. But I will add a little edit like I did, you know, my video post on her when I show you my analytics. That's my first stage of editing. That's as much as, bro, that's as much as I, I know a little bit more. But like I said, it could get overwhelming. It could get frustrated. Anxiety can kick in. Oh, you know, you can be like, man, I, I can't do this. I can't. I edit this video for two hours. And then when you edit a video for two whole hours, you post it, you only get three views. That's OK. At least you took that step. At least you tried. And like I said, those three people, they got this message. They got this information that they need from you because God is using you. God loves you and he wants to continue to use you. God is blessing you and all you have to do is keep editing. That th Those three people, you probably changed their lives. Those three people, one of them can be in the Philippines. One of them can be in Uganda, Africa. One of them can be in Europe. One of them can even be in Texas, Kansas, you know, Arkansas. I can name all the states, Chicago, Florida was going on. One person in Florida can see your video. My storage is getting full. Sorry, I paused it. So Florida's having so many issues. Some that out of those three people, somebody can be blessed off your video. Somebody can be encouraged to where they start a YouTube. You can encourage those three people. So don't worry about those three views. Keep posting. Like my views, I had 12 views on one of my videos. Then I had a 4,000 views. So you got to keep posting, stay consistent, give them information that they need and you will be successful. This is my YouTube journey. I'm going to do part three tomorrow. I'm, I might be at part four or something, but I'm, a, I'm starting a part, a series. So I'm just going to say part three is coming tomorrow. This is part two. And like I said, guys, do not give up. Talk to God before you post. Say, God, give me the right words to say. And then, like I said, YouTube recommend to do an eight or plus minute video. That's the sweet spot. So if you do one, do it over eight minutes. Sometimes mine's be, I'm starting to get more into eight to the 12 minute thing if my phone storage don't run out. But I'm going to keep staying consistent. I'm going to keep posting. I'm going to keep sharing my mistakes. I'm going to keep sharing my brain farts, my tongue tides. I'm not going to stop. I'm going to stay consistent. I'm going to stay posting. And that is the key to be monetized. That's the key to have success in YouTube because people want real. And before I get off here, I'm going to say this is a key note I want you to remember. To be a good leader, you must be a good reader. To be a great leader, you must be real to yourself and real to others. People wants to follow people that's real and not always right. I don't want to follow nobody that's always right because I'm going to be like, man, he think he's always right. I'm going to have that in the back of my head. People want to follow people and be inspired by people who are always real. If you're not right, be real. And that's what I'm being right now to you guys. Uh, I love you guys. If you want to subscribe, uh, hit subscribe. If you want to um, comment something in the comment section of what I can do a next video on my monetization journey, let me know. And I hope this 